Hello everyone. For the repair today we have this Fluke 177. Customer bring it in because the multimeter doesn't work right. Some reading and the multimeter doesn't uh, read right. So we're going to plug it to the DC uh, external power supply and see if we're going to have the same reading as the power supply. Well, it's, it's like it's not reading anything. It just stuck at the millivolt. The same thing, the alternative voltage, the EC it doesn't measure in right as well. I did test it with 110 volt. It doesn't read uh, anything right. So let's take it apart and we'll locate it inside. Hopefully it's going to be just a burned resistor and fuse. Let's test the battery, because sometimes if the battery is very low, it may cause the wrong reading. But in this case, the battery tests about like 9.5 volt. We test these fuses. It tests good. Let's check the multimeter more apart. Uh, this is a low ohm resistor here fuse. This is good. This is a rectified bridge. It's kind of tests a low ohm in this, uh, the input of the rectified bridge. The output of it, it is okay. Will be that rectify bridge is connected to the select wheel. So let's turn it and see if we have any different reading. Still have like a low ohm over there. This is a one kilo ohm resistor. It's a brown, black, and the red. Yeah, checking the multimeter, I don't see any burning mark or a big uh, smoke. This is a, like a resistor and they have a tiny burn mark over there. So in this chip, there is uh, like um, a lot of resistors, they connect in a different way. Uh, Let's see what's going on with that rectified bridge. If it is internally short or is something set up like that. Uh, the rectified bridge testing good. But in the board, it is like 36 ohm. And I'm going to solder the rectify bridge back in the place and we keep working. Right, let's go on the computer and look for that uh, resistor. We have seven pins this side, then three, then one. Now 
and that's the part number I can get in it then for that part That resistor is look like this one, but uh, it's a different ones. And here, this picture, yeah, they show how the resistors is set up. But it's not any matching the resistance, the the chip that we have. Yeah, this part is the. For the fluke, but is a like a bench uh, multimeter. Yeah, in this site, I can't find any searching option. For the multimeter that I do have, or for the resistor uh, part number. So I can't find any replacement for these uh, these resistors, and I can't find the, the value of the the resistance here, so I can check it. And that's all. If you have any idea where to find this resistor, just let me know. And uh, that's all. So till we find uh, the replacement of this resistor, this device repair is going to be in hold. So that's all for this video. Thank you for watching and see you again.